And to think I could have been playing the new Doom Eternal DLC right about now, if I just aimed at the floor. Good work, Castle. At this rate, you'll have a book written about you detailing every single mistake you've made. Maybe this one will be good enough to have its own chapter. Simple kindness must not be a part of her framework. It definitely explain the attitude. Hey, hey, you look like the kind of person that needs a stylish product. And you look like the type of person I'd use to decorate the store with. Get out! Drop the money and run! I swear, the next person who walks through that damn door is getting a shotgun to the face. At least the store's quiet. Outside of the occasional lunatic. Aim into the toilet next time, you wrinkly old freak! The drug pushers. I'm about to shove that needle straight into your eye. And... The suicidal bosses. God damn it. Rick! Get out here! Another manager's gone and gouged their eyes out again! I wonder if all these crazy events are happening because I opt that tall homeless person stalking me inside the store. They had it coming. That whole locking the door behind me joke got old. Real fast. Speaking of things that get old real fast, I haven't seen... Do you mind? I'm in the middle of something here! Oh, God damn it! Now I've got to clean that up. I wonder what that trailer is like. I think they included difficult Marauder encounters this time around. You'd think with how much of a push he had during promotional material. But what about the new stuff? There's got to be at least one additional new enemy added to the roster. Can't imagine there being any new areas for Doomguy to visit either. Hell's been done to death, which leaves Eridak the only viable option to expand on. I've really got to break the habit of talking to myself one of these days. Hmm. Hmm. Where the hell is my damn co-worker? Bastard hasn't shown his face around this store for a couple of days. Where the hell is he? All right. I thought I'd never be free from his shenanigans. Life is kind of cool sometimes. There's probably going to be nothing left by the time I'm finally allowed back in. I don't know what's worse. The purgatory-like isolation? Or the fact my figurines are likely getting destroyed as I speak? a stunt like that, I wouldn't be surprised if they take... Listen, I don't have time to talk. I'm in a hurry. So would you get off your lazy ass and fetch me five cans of beer and a pack of cigarettes? Make it quick. <sighs> as expected.